Genre-wise, Nova 111 is a challenge to place. On its surface, it's a turn-based puzzle game, rescuing scientists and defeating enemies in order to reach the exit. The entire world is not turn-based, however, and the strange mix of real-time and turn-based combat make it lean more towards an action title. Then there's the constant inclusion of new items, which upgrade your ship and make it easier to tackle more formidable enemies. There's also hidden treasure caches that will improve your health if you find four of them. These last two points scream Zelda clone. Honestly though, due to exploring alien worlds in your spaceship and rescuing scientists, the whole thing comes off to me as a turn-based pixel junk shooter with some real-time elements. Although while Pixel Junk Shooter allows for somewhat free movement, Nova 111 funnels you through tight crevices with only a dash of side exploration to find the aforementioned treasure, or an optional scientist. It's definitely one of those solve what we put in front of you type of games. The way it expands what it has to offer is rather ingenious. You'll come across a new enemy or barrier that seems harder than it should be, especially with what you have available to you. Only after getting past it will the game present a new upgrade to you, which makes future encounters a lot easier to manage. With this in place, there is no danger of coming across a solution before you know what the problem is.